So she's going to, to open the refrigerator. So that was successfully opening the bottle. And now, now comes the milk to the Who closed this bottle that much? Dynamite had some problems in finding the gripper. It's really complex to, to find and open the fridge. Uh, I will tell you more about that later. Um, Uh, so let's see, it's a little bit, yeah, that looks good, yes, and there is some milk to the cereals, the last drops also belong to the bowl, right, good job for the row. And um, the fridge is now open, and um, Dynamate is going to grasp the orange That juice. looks tasty. Since you have guests, I suggest that you eat with a spoon today. I will get it for you in a minute. First, I have to look at the empty bottle. So the empty bottle, of course, belongs to the trash can, so we have some cleaning up here. Because when we have our breakfast, we don't want to have all the mess. It also belongs to uh, preparing a breakfast. Looks better this way. And now we'll get you the spoon. Yeah. Both robots are fair and do not collide with each other. There is the orange juice that is now put on the table. And Cosero is going to come here to get the spoon. And um, what is really special here, uh, luckily we have already heard from, from uh, other teams like the BitBots that there is something like segmentation and objects and stuff like that. But what we are doing uh, and what you can maybe see here as soon as um, the perception is started is that um, we do it a little bit different, so we have very fast uh, methods for computing local surface numbers and doing segmentation. So we submit it to the uh, RoboCup Symposium. So here you see the table, you see the uh, spoon. And the red thing is uh, that we track the position of the spoon because we can do that segmentation with 30 hertz. We track the position of the spoon, compute the sizes, and we use this information to compute the uh, Placing up your cereal. And yeah, in the meantime, uh, Dynamite closes the refrigerator doing some uh, combined task space control. So there is a one, uh, one degree of freedom is not controlled but can adapt to uh, the motion of the door. And uh, well, then it might be another day. Yeah. So the, uh, the, refri uh, the refrigerator is closed. And, um, well, we see uh, segmentation, what I mentioned is um, that we track positions, sizes, and the oriented bounding box of the objects, and then we can compute the, an optimal grasp to, to, to grasp these objects. So you can really, I mean, put bananas there and whatever it is. And, um, That's it, so far. You can order me out of the kitchen in any direction. Just point where I should leave. So now, uh, and uh, make a pointing gesture to the world to one of the exits, if you like. Just uh, stand oh, yeah, in front of the <laughs>